Tesla has presented incredible plans to extend its Giga Texas project by constructing a 220,000 square foot warehouse across the Colorado River close to its Giga Texas factory. If the plans are approved, the warehouse will be an extension of Tesla's existing vehicle manufacturing plant in Texas, in the eastern suburbs of the city of Austin. Let's get into the facts. On February 2, 2022, the Colorado River Project LLC was listed as a co-applicant in a filing for a building permit in Austin under the code name CATHO. We deduce this project is being commissioned by Tesla since Colorado River Project LLC is the name Tesla has used throughout state and local licensing processes for its new factory. You'll also discover why the program named CATHO is significant to Tesla's 4680 battery. Tesla's mission is to fast-track the world's transition to sustainable energy by making electric vehicles and energy products more affordable. Tesla alone will require today's entire global supply of lithium-ion batteries to manufacture 500,000 cars per year. The Tesla Giga factory was commissioned to supply enough batteries to meet Tesla's projected vehicle demand. The Giga factory now manufactures Model 3 electric motors and battery packs, and Tesla's energy storage products, Powerwall and Powerpack. We have the best video for you if you want to learn more about Tesla's latest state-of-the-art battery. It focuses on Tesla's 4680 battery, which sets the pace in the electronic vehicle EV sector. The warehouse will cost an estimated $11 million, according to paperwork filed with the Texas Department of Licensing and Regulation. According to the filings, the land set aside for construction is owned by an individual who has a close relationship with Elon Musk. We will highlight this relationship later and reveal how it helped us predict that Tesla was behind the filing. The records also suggest that the warehouse will be 220,000 square feet in size and will be located across the Colorado River near the existing Giga Texas facility. The warehouse's construction is scheduled to begin on June 1, 2022 and is expected to be completed on June 1, 2023. Bear in mind that considerable changes to the project are still possible. For example, at Giga Berlin, the battery factory was initially approved as a warehouse, but Tesla eventually got permission to establish a battery factory instead. Elon Musk revealed in Tesla's fourth quarter and annual earnings call that Giga Texas Model Y vehicles will run on the company's structural battery pack with 4680 cells. He also announced that Model Y vehicles assembled in late 2021 already had Tesla's structural battery pack and 4680 cells, according to Tesla's senior VP of powertrain and energy engineering Drew Baglino. The company is making progress with tool installations at Giga Texas for the daily production of 4680 battery packs, which are then installed on vehicles. Tesla intends to initiate customer deliveries of Model Ys built in Giga Texas once the EPA, Environmental Protection Agency, certifies the 4680 battery cells and structural battery pack utilized in the new model. Why it is noteworthy that this paperwork is required for a car to go on the market. These certificates issued after vehicles are tested in the EPA and Arbor Lab to ensure they meet the EPA emissions criteria are only valid for a model year. Furthermore, the EPA has stated that once the Texas-made Model Y is approved, Tesla can begin deliveries Following CEO Elon Musk's September revelation that Tesla planned to establish a cathode facility as part of its battery cell production plant, we can confirm that Tesla applied for the building permit mentioned earlier to expand Gigafactory Texas to make cathodes. An Austin City spokesperson told Reuters, I can confirm that this is for the Tesla project, and this permit is for a cathode building. She went on to say that the city has no more information on the matter. Consequently, we believe the Giga Texas cathode plant will most certainly contribute to Tesla's Austin 46A production plans. Tell us the role a cathode plays in a battery in the comment section below. According to the filing, the land is owned by Horse Ranch LLC, which is purportedly tied to Tesla CEO Elon Musk via Jared Burchall, who serves on the board of the Musk Foundation and manages the Tesla and SpaceX CEO family office. He was named the Horse Ranch LLC manager on the property records and in filings with the Texas Secretary of State's office. 
Tesla's vehicle manufacturing site was certified by the Texas Commission on Environmental Quality on January 20, 2022. Several additional licenses are still pending with the Commission which must give air quality permits for manufacturing sites that emit pollution. Cathodes are the most expensive component of a battery. Their production takes up a lot of space and generates a lot of carbon dioxide. With its Texas Giga factory, Tesla seeks to reduce the cost of manufacturing these batteries and by extension, its vehicles. In simple terms, Tesla's electric vehicles are about to get cheaper, which is cause for celebration particularly for fans of electric cars. If you'd like to get high-quality content just like this, kindly click the subscribe button.